We're Colleen and Brian Cook, and we are honored to be the chairs of this evening's event. Mental health is very special to us, and especially it is special to Moses and Gwen Brewer, our best friends in life. We want to congratulate Mental Health on this evening's event, and congratulate Moses and Gwen on their accomplishments and everything that they have brought to this organization and bring to this community. We love you dearly, and it was an honor for us to share this with you, and we thank you for that, and we love you dearly. I, I couldn't uh, start this out without not only acknowledging, but thanking Gene Romer. Let me tell you why. Um, this organization was run so well for so long that by the time it got to me to take the reins, it was teed up so incredibly well to take it to the next level. And that really is all because of Gene Miller. So Gene, wherever you are, we want to give you one uh, acknowledgement. Where are you, Gene? How did you, really how did you get, get to this organization? Um, it was about five or six years ago. Uh, my phone rang, and it was my youngest brother. And my young brother, who lives in, in uh, the Midwest in a rural a part of uh, Missouri, was calling, and he was, uh, in essence, in a, in a suicidal state. And that was quite the shock. Uh, and and uh, myself and, and uh, my brothers, one of whom you're going to get here tonight, um, had to kind of group and say, well, wow, this is, this is quite intense. And, and we really had to grapple with uh, having a family member who has some serious mental illness. Uh, and it, it put life around an issue that I had worked on in the legislature but never had personal contact with. And now I am so blessed to lead an organization that really gets out and makes a difference around this issue. I'm very, very proud to be a part of it. This is an organization that I feel very, very fortunate to be a part of. Because I think it does the kinds of things that I feel that are comfortable with. The commitment to people who need help and the support in our community. The advocacy part of it plays a very key role. And so, um, my, and I'm also blessed in the fact that my company also has a big commitment. And we've been doing this for the last nine years or so. I'm just so pleased to be involved in all of it. I want to thank you for being part of it. And I uh, appreciate them giving us this opportunity. Thank you very much. Well, uh, as a past chair and a current board member of MHAC, I am so honored that they selected my husband Moses and I to be this year's honorees. I still can't believe it, and I, I truly believe that any other member on the board could also have served.